All right, moving on now. The House of Representatives has inaugurated the Ad Hoc Committee on Unclaimed Funds in Nigeria Commercial Bank and Infractions by the Central Bank of Nigeria. Meanwhile, the members of the committee have vowed to recover the over 1.2 trillion now held in most commercial banks in order to assist the government finance the 2022 budget and kept the high rate of unemployment, inflation and insecurity in the country. Emmanuel Ehijide completes the report. According to the chairman of the ad hoc committee, Honorable Oyine Idem, the aim is to assist the federal government in financing the 2022 budget through recovery of hanging funds in the possession of unauthorized persons, individuals and corporate bodies. He said the recovery will help in dealing with the ever-increasing budget deficit, settling foreign and domestic debts, amongst others. This assignment is very important. The assignment is very crucial. It is very sensitive, given the time of uh, our economy in the country, what we are facing at the moment. So that would inform the outcome to mandate this committee, this all important committee, to embark on this assignment. We believe that uh, the outcome of it will help the country. Stakeholders applauded the initiative and promised to assist the committee in its findings. Uh, it would appear that this is focused on, uh, on helping the federal government balances belonging to the federal government and its uh, agencies that may still be hanging in any of the uh, commercial banks, uh, which indeed would uh, ordinarily be uh, an act of insecurity given the um, implementation of the TSA, where with grants best of my knowledge. The speaker who was represented by the deputy speaker Idris Wase says the assignment of the ad hoc committee is backed by the constitution and will help to expose corruption in the system. This I believe from the body of the motion that about 1.2 trillion not paid into consultation with my brother, I believe the director of the budget, who is between the minister, will need to have this money into the funds of the federation so that we can improve the infrastructure deficit and other challenges in our nation. I believe it is important, hoping and praying what was mentioned, if it is true, it means then we have a lot to do. The investigation continues with different dates to be fixed for all commercial banks to appear. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.